What's up, everyone? Welcome back to your Call of Duty. You can see it. Make sure it's working on Twitch. Twitch, Twitch, Twitch. What's the sound? Is it working? Bradley was right. This place is much older than I imagined. He went over here anyways. Someone must really hate Charles Hawkins. I told you. Silas Winchester is still watching over the Hawkins family. I must say, it's pretty gloomy. So, Detective, does this place inspire any thoughts? Your mom? Ha 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 ha! Uh... Say someone distracted one of the graves? Do you know if Charles Hawkins had any enemies? Not to our knowledge. He was a well-respected personality on the island. I, I don't understand. Silas would never have let such a thing happen. Why were they buried here? I was given to believe that it was Charles Hawkins' wish. Strange idea. I imagine Webster wasn't too pleased. Mrs. Hawkins' father? It's said that he's devastated. Let's go to the mansion. Please give me a minute. I didn't expect to set foot back here after the burial. What kind of deranged individual would defile this? Someone must really hate Charles Hawkins.
Poor kid. There's a kid? Poor kid. I remember the fire. This place looks like a nightmare. <laughs> oh, let me try something. I'm gonna just see what I can do. Uh, come here. Am I quieter than I was? my sound audio in the chat right now that way I can options audio turn up microphone all the way up Higher. That was sounding in the mic. Do we sound better now? Should I just keep my my headset like this? We're gonna keep my headset like this. This this should work because this game must be pretty fucked up if you can hear my little ass. Okay, maybe turn down the game volume. Try that. Is that still louder than me? No, I'm not. Haha, <laughs> motherfucker. I'll have to find another entrance. Goosey goose. Come on, give me 
your second girlfriend's now texting me. When your lady texts you, you text back. Otherwise, you're in deep shit. This entrance is still in use. Shouldn't every door be still in use? Whoa! Whoa! Oh, it's the. It's you are trying to force the door, you nosy prick! Easy, sir. Hey, man. Right. Hey, man. Put down the axe. You know what we do with Listen, a like you? We're, we're, we're friends. We're homies. We got them. Dump them into the ocean. Whoa! Uh, uh. You're. Mr. Winchester, lower that axe. <clears throat> Let's talk calmly. Yeah, I'm going show that how we have it out on dark water. Okay, okay. Oh, shit, we're tired. Um, please? Sarah Hawkins' father sent me here to investigate the death of his daughter. Webster, huh? I understand how he feels. But me? I want the dead to rest in peace. And that means kicking the ass of gumshoes like you. Why would you not want me to help understand what happened here? I've got nothing to... Uh, that was my bad. Uh, I actually I tell me what you're doing here. And no baloney. The police report describes a domestic accident. But Stephen Webster has several reasons to believe that this may not be the case. Webster is as stubborn as an old mule. And I did tell him that we should let the dead rest in peace. He wants to restore the reputation of his daughter. I just need to see where the fire started. The mansion isn't safe. You would break your neck as sure as you're trying my patience right now. That's why you barricaded the entrance. That's right. And this door? It's locked. And I make sure it stays that way. Um, understandable, but you shouldn't really need this key. No one lives in the mansion, and you don't take care of it anymore. If you have a good reason to be here, I'm listening. There's vermin. I keep an eye out. Vermin? Yeah, that's it. Vermin. Right. This is what we're going to do. I go inside, and I promise that I'll hunt vermin. Okay with you? Mm, I'm not sure. If there's nothing else to fear, you can give me that key. Uh, right. Take the key and do what you have to do. Go on, then. Just to get rid of you. Let's see what more I can learn from this mansion. This gate is locked. Shit, Sherlock. I think it's a bad idea. Um, maybe, 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 maybe. Some sort of hint. There. Got that. But I want to explore. I choose to explore because exploring. 
thing is cool, and that's what cool people do. The poor wretch yeah. seems to spend the best part of his time. Rather Spartan. The caretaker has simple tastes. Is there anything here besides... There's toxic fumes. Let's see what... Is it open? No? Oof. Okay, little lighthouse. Town. Very pretty, very pretty. This is such a spooky, spooky land, but you know, it's okay. Ooh. Yes, because breaking and entering is what we do. Um, okay, well, there was no point for breaking and entering because we came to break and entering. So, we're going to go up to the manor and do our little quest. Because uh, apparently Home Slice doesn't want to do anything about this little area unless so I missed it. Yo, thank you for yes. opening. Shall we enter? Now that you've finished your fun and games with Silas, we can perhaps inspect the mansion. You're right. Let's go. Yes, sir. Enter Let's the mansion. I'm with Man, you. Man, this is a manor. This thing's gonna be massive, dude. Pierce and Officer Bradley explored the gardens of the Hawkins Mansion. The family lies in the graveyard of the property guarded by the the Silas Winchester. Oh, guarded by Silas Winchester. That's his whole name. The old caretaker, still faithful to his employee employers, keeps watch on the place. Armed with his axe, Pierce and Bradley manage to calm him down and finally get a hold of the key to the Hawkins mansion. They enter the building looking for the scene of the fire. Okay, well, that's bullshit because uh, Bradley didn't do anything. He was looking at the tombstones of the dead. Okay, I was doing everything. I was saying, hey, man, drop the axe. Let's talk, you know. So that was bullshit, but you know, that's okay. We're not judging. Oh, Follow sorry, me. I wasn't... <laughs> I know the place. Who left this light on? Well, who left these lights on is the better question. There's there's more than just one light, Bradley. Fucking nut. Okay. The Last Supper of the Hawkins. What does this Ew. tell me? Detective mode. Whoosh. 
No, like what pepper. kind of meat is this? Oh, bullocks. This place is for the head of the family, Charles Hawkins. The boy was probably here. Smashed his plate on the floor. Of course he did, poor kid. I was scared that dad was going to be angry with him. Yeah, angry man. Sarah Hawkins plate. Why did she leave it untouched? Something happened at this table. An argument? Oh, maybe. Maybe. Hey, Pierce. Daydreaming again? Working, officer. This dinner table tells us a lot about the Hawkins family life. Well, we don't have all day. The scene of the fire is next door. Um, actually, let's keep looking around real quick. I want to make sure I get every single detail as possible before we go on. Hello, hello. Oh, I was not a toy. Is that a nutcracker? Bradley, Bradley, hold my hand. I don't like this mansion. Bradley, this mansion is scary. Too much rubble. I'll find an easier way. Oh, Was Charles know. Hawkins some kind of explorer? Well, good for him. Does he have anything? Charles Hawkins, some kind of explorer. So we know he's an explorer. Married. They seem happy. But Charles is already looking off into the future. His marriage just to stop along the way. Obviously, he's looking off in the future. Let's see if I can find something the cops missed. Like Bradley? <clears throat> they had a fight. Why? Um, kid? Did Sarah Hawkins lose one of her shoes? Ooh, she's on the table? Oh. So she must have, like... Okay. Did it stop at the time of the fire? The child's corpse left a trace. Oh, Where no. Where are the others? Oh, that's terrible. Was Charles Hawkins a heavy drinker? If the painting I found on the docks really came from here, how come it didn't burn? Because it's a cold like thing? So they had a fight. And they died. I just want to make sure I got everything. What's a check mark at the bottom? How do I press? Okay. Um. Hmm. Let me move my chair up. Okay. Come on. Check the door. Ooh, see? Did someone escape the fire? Wouldn't the, the caretaker notice? Blood. This lab was thrown. This was no accident. This was a fight.
Someone fell here. A desperate attempt to flee. So, detective, what do you make of it? Well, time from what I've seen. It's official the police rushed the investigation. Clues don't match. Or it wasn't just an accident. I firmly believe this fire was more than just an accident. I was about to say, we need to make friends with Bradley. What's your theory? I think the Hawkins couple got into a fight. You sure of that? There's only one way to be sure. I just ask that you don't disturb anything. If Chief West found out about what we're doing, I'd be in serious trouble. Who cares about Chief West? I don't think he's ever coming up here anyways. You're going over there. I'll go over here. This door is. Never locked. mind. I'll, I'll go over there too. History of medicine in the. Wow. Fifteenth century. Did I read that correctly? No, eighteenth. My bad. I'm stupid. Saying no, those practices are being followed. Um, can I level up? Let's see, you're 45%. 45. Oh, I'm not going to do yet. That's okay. Um, I want to upgrade my strength. Say that. Thirty-five percent. Hit that. Hit that one more time. You're fine. Upgrade that. Get them all to forty-five. Okay. Get them all to forty. That works. That works great. City nightmares. Okay, well, we're about to go insane. This is a character This is so cool, dude. Games. Yeah, when was that? Ten? I'm assuming this could be important later. <laughs> Look at the flame physics, though, on my lighter. Okay, cool, cool, cool. These bandages are covered in dried blood. The yeah, same just... bandages that I saw in the warehouse on the docks. And given the blood stains, I'd also say that it's the same person. What the f- I didn't even ask Google to do that. Thank you, though. It's, like, made me go like, what? Ooh, there's something here, though. There's a little, little mystery thing here, eh? The lyrics of the drunken sailor. A sea shanty. This door is blocked from the outside. Is there literally only one way in and one way out? Can't go up there. Shucks. Ooh, painting. 
picture of my friend. Or am I not important? Okay. So we keep going straight. An original edition of Mary Shelley's Frankenstein. Dated cool, 1818. Well, there's something here. The lyrics of the drunken sailor, the sea shanty. Let me move you. Ooh, hi. Crowbar. Really belongs to the caretaker. A crowbar could prove useful. Oh yeah, no. Can we start breaking with things? No. What's happening? Creepy music. Why? Whoa. classic. The epic battle between man and whale. Mandatory reading for any whaler, I guess. A nice library. Something's gonna appear. I feel like I missed something and that's why they could be... A book on the first inhabitants of the island. It seems they got here around the 14th century. Human body. We're messing. Mess and knowledge we're getting, we're gonna learn how to communicate. What do you know about Charles Hawkins' activities? Well, not much to be honest. We all assume the Hawkins lived on Charles's inheritance. I didn't even select my, my nice little letter, by the way. That just happened. Just, just saying, you know, it just came up. Uh, Greek mythology. Hecate, goddess of the dead, daughter of Tartarus, and mother of Scylla. There's papers everywhere, dude. One of Sarah Hawkins' paintings. Her style sure is recognizable. Twenty thousand leagues under the sea. Another story about the mysteries of the deep. So they were into a lot of mysteries of the water. What could Sarah have done to make this person threaten to call the police? You know, I have no respect. Unfortunately, I can no longer continue to close my eyes. Behavior of the water. Last week, she again terrified my client. My clientele, my bad. 
I know. I know that she means no harm. But you should place her in her in the care of a doctor. Of Doctor Fuller, he alone seems able to make her comes with her senses. If these disturbances were to recur. Believe me that although, sorry, I don't know why I just started looking at my phone because I'm weird. Believe me that although it would feel like torture, I, I would be, uh, 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 be obliged to involve the police. Respects respectfully yours, Anton Will Willard. These don't look nice. Locked. Thank you. Have to locked. Oh. Oh. The boys' room. Well, I don't like how dark it is, man. Charles Ford. From what threat was Sun protecting his world? Tom Sawyer. Mark Twain. Sarah must have read it to him before bed. Sleeping pills. Strong for an eleven year old boy. What was wrong with this family? Those are pictures. What nightmarish vision could have inspired them? Yeah, I was about to say, what is that? Simon's troubles went beyond family problems. That kid saw something. Something terrified him. Yeah, no, clearly. Dude, that's so cool. I don't like how we just got super quiet. That's that's not okay, man. That's that's really not okay. That how we got like really quiet. Was that door that Sarah Hawkins' office was concealed. Where was her office? What will her room reveal about her? Barbiturates. Sarah Hawkins must have been extremely agitated resorting to such a treatment. Yeah, it does a depressant of the nervous system, but once you begin, you can never live without them. Of that, I know something. Perfect. Yeah. <laughs> Bradley! Bradley! <laughs> okay. We can't be too bad here, man. That's just nothing but like a cult circle. This ledger lists all of the paintings Sarah Hawkins sold. It seems was the last she... one was given for free to a Frances Sanders. I'm assuming that she was a part of the cult. 
obviously she is, but I'm assuming that she sold these paintings and then other people can be part of that group. Yeah? Yeah? Me, you know what I'm saying? Was Sarah Hawkins interested in the occult? What was she trying to achieve? Bradley? Fuck. Is that you? Where's Bradley? Is anyone there? <clears throat> Bradley? Oh yeah, I picked up the lantern, yeah, totally. Great idea. Some light, dude. Take it with you. You don't hear the little noise, dude. There's someone in that room. Me? Stop! Jump down, can we jump down? Where'd he go? Bradley, did you see which way he went? Who? I didn't see anyone. Of course he didn't. I heard some noise. I knew, right? A man was hiding on the upper level. He ran when he saw me. He can't be far. I'll cover you. Well, he clearly went this way because... Because Bradley was coming down that way. This door was closed earlier. What door? Hold on. Give me one second. Time out, time out.
we are back. Let me make sure everything's working again because oh, I'm so sorry. Um, she tried to prank me. It was it was it was work effort. So she tried. Bad timing. Five. Talk to me, Goose. Where are we at? Checking. One, two, three. Oh, like the whole video is like frozen, my bad. Okay, just wanted to make sure. <clears throat> okay, here we go. Um, so he said this room was closed, or which room was closed? He said, or no, it was this one. Literally the door, the door that's like right in front of us. Where did he go? Must have got out some way. No, no, he was here. I'm sure. Let's search this room. I'm assuming if I were to hide, it would be like a secret compartment. This looks interesting. This globe seems to have been part of some mechanism. Doesn't work. I must have missed something. The map. It looks like an old seaway map. Hawkins was keeping her father's letters from her. Oh, good for her. I guess. Good for him. Way to be a real, real jerk, man. They look like Celtic runes. Lovely. Charles must have brought them back from one of his foreign trips. As if the bookcase has been moved. I knew it! Times. There's a secret compartment! Clearly, Charles Hawkins knew Captain Fitzroy very well. I wonder who the man with the glasses is in the photograph. It looks like a freehand map of dark water. Certain areas have been highlighted. I wonder why. Hold on to that. The Scylla. It's the boat that was stranded at the entrance to the harbor. This panel is movable. Cogwheels. They must be linked to an opening mechanism. Probably a secret passage. I must oh. find a way to activate the opening. I know where the opening mechanism is. Of course. No. With this, work. I should be able to force the gears. Well done, Pierce. Is that the police is part of it? What are we part of the cult? Chapter 4, Tunnels. Sorry, that might have been a little bit too loud.
Okay. See how we wrap up with audio? Inside the Hawkins Mansion. Ooh, we're fine. We're actually perfect. That's beautiful. Okay. Inside the Hawkins Mansion, the scene of the fire revealed its secret. Pearson Officer Bradley, now on the trail of his driver, had un undertaken to search the place, a place looking for proof. When a hooded man leaped into Sarah Hawkins' workshop to steal a painting, following him the office, the office, oh wait, the painting, detective and police officer set off after him. By following him to the office of Charles Hawkins, they discover a secret passage. Pierce and Bradley enter the tunnel under the mansion. <gasps> secret That's... passage under the manor. It's like a detective novel. That guy must have already gotten far. Yeah. And he had a direct means of entry to the crime scene. We must find him. Three seats. Oh. I don't know if we want to find him. You know. Look, someone's been here recently. No dirt, dude. This is like conjuring three right now. Did Charles Hawkins use this place? No, it's three. It's three. Who were the others? Yeah, no, it's three. It's three, right? Were they allowed to go underground to fight that cult lady? What is this mask? I am not messing up on my my conjuring binge, I promise. Ew, why so creepy? It's tentacle man, eh? Where am I going? Whatever Charles Hawkins hid here, he didn't want it in his house. Are you sure it was Charles Hawkins and not the daughter? What if the daughter's still alive? Did they actually find the body? Just theories. So spooky. What are you? You, you want to look at that thing? Really? Check both doors. This piece of cloth is unmistakably from a dress. Ooh, Sarah she discovered Hawkins it. Here. Cause of night, really? Push. I fall? No. Y'all really want to look through this? Man. <laughs> oh no. Let's see what's in here. This symbol. What does it mean? What does it mean? It means darkness. A disfigured saint. What does it mean? What does it mean? I don't know, man. It means, uh... Death to all? I don't know. A lot of cults like to do that, I guess. I don't know. Well, I mean... They could have made this like a wicked man cave instead of like some creepy ass cult room. But you know, whatever floats your boat, I guess. Of course. And something tells me that the There's king someone there. is climbing these steps. There's tunnels all over this island. Could you Give be any louder, cave. bro? There's gotta be other entrances. Did you guys just not- continues further down. Might as well start with that. I ain't gonna sweep in there. I'll find another way. If possible, I prefer not to ruin my uniform. Fine, fine. Go look for another entrance. I'll try my luck down below. Be careful, please. Uh, did any of you guys just, like, completely just ignore the guy that just walked by and didn't say anything about that?
you know. Just, just saying. Oh, this is bad news. This is not good, man. This is a mistake. Oh, those are totems. Some kind of dream catcher. Or, yeah, if I touch it, it'll turn to dust. Dream catchers is a lot better than totems. That's not totem. Totems are down on the ground. I forgot about that. Man, you could have made this like a wicked cool party cave. This could have been like a rave down here. If it, you know, nothing just like, you know, destroyed itself. World didn't collapse in on you, but you know, just saying, just saying, just, just my opinion. You know, you made it really, really cool. What are you? This monstrous creature must be an allegory. You're starting to believe in it. How are you? What is that thing? Walking down the river, going through the mountain. What the hell? Oh, well, that's pretty cool. I dig how they did this, how the game designers made this. This is pretty freaking neat. I'm assuming we're going to go down there. You know? Anyways. It's a lot to explore. Can we open this now? So the guy went up there. Do you have a gun on you? I mean, I'm not all for killing Time you, has weakened these structures. Like, I got a bad, bad, bad feeling about this. We're gonna fall down there eventually, I feel like it. We're gonna have to run away and then we're gonna have to fall. Well, just investigate. I don't have time to search them all. Well, you could have searched one, and then you could probably estimate the others. Of course it opens. I was really hoping it didn't. What's going on here? Be cold. Keep your voice down. We're not alone. Good God. What have you got me into? You could leave any time now. We'll see. I'll go on. Try to go down on your side. Yeah, th there's a passage. I'll meet you at the bottom. Oh, real quick. Explore this real quick, because there might be something down here. This oil again. What is it used for? It's not oil, it's a hallucinogenics. We're going to pollute the water in the city. Maybe it's just for something else. Maybe I am. Maybe, maybe it's just. Maybe it is oil. 
but it just looks like it's gonna be like poisoning. It's like Scarecrow's toxin. It looks like that. Uh, Joker's poison gas, which did happen. Me? A table for sacrifice? out of here. Freaking out, you gotta breathe. Is it... Is it my turn? Yes. It is time. You will soon be one of us. If your body and mind are ready. I dream of it every night. I have constant visions. I am ready. Good enough. Prove it to us. It's like in my dream. You dreamed about someone becoming a cult? It's crazy, bro. It seems to have been used recently. Probably some sort of ritual. What kind of bone is that? I can't read Latin. I can't, but we'll, we'll upgrade it, no worries. I'm assuming this way is locked. Yup. Okay, well we're gonna go down here anyways. Assuming that's not locked. This place looks like it's from your dream. Where's Bradley? You who sleep, accept this dreamer under your immortal name. Ya Cthulhu Nithsaha Fitag. Grant him your flesh and accept his, so that his body and yours may be one. 
Sleep? We're dead. Dead? This ritual killed him. Where's the sense in that? Rituals, man. Writing mean. Explore the caves, they said. We are ready for the ceremony. Figure what out what about to my daughter, your they said. His awakening is complete. He will join you shortly. Bradley, what are you doing here? I saw two odd looking guys coming down. Seemed up to no good. What in the world is this? An intruder! Oh shit! Don't move! Police! Don't move! Uh, Tentacle Man doesn't like that. <laughs> Bradley. I won't hesitate! Bradley, get Bradley. back! Bradley. Get back! You asked for it! Oh, that's a bad idea. Ooh, nice shot! Go, go, go. They're caving in. I need to get out of here. So he has super strength. Well, that sucks. Did I die? I was almost there, dude. Uh, 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 my leg. Uh. What are we looking at? Oh my gosh, we can't even see our own leg. We get chopped off. And you killed your own cult members. Why would you do that? Let's get out of here, man. Light! At last. It's not the right light, though. Oh. <sighs> Chapter 5. Pierce and Officer Bradley follow the intruder to the secret meeting place of a cult. Set a network of underground caves. Right under the Hawkins Manor. 
They witnessed a strange ceremony led by a Charles Hawkins. Very much alive, Bradley tried to arrest him, but Hawkins, whose body displayed various mis mutations, disemboweled, disemboweled the police officer as he tried to escape from him. As he tried to escape from him, Pierce found himself prisoner of a rock ball. Rushed to the Riverside Institute, he is in a critical state. Great. What's our time at? Oh, 73 minutes. Oh, we got time. This game would like to load. Dr. Fuller. Is that the wife? No. Well, probably not, actually. He's having a seizure. He would survive. Strong research. You can certainly say that you gave us a scare. <laughs> what did you do to me? What? You're Undo dead. these straps! Whoa! Go easy, my friend. You were dead. He killed you. Are you sure he's better? He was... He was dead. Me too! We, we were dead! What are you doing? I'm sorry, my friend. What? No! <sighs> what happened to me? Where am I? I'm in the same as I <laughs> This foul gas again. Anders, you have to come with us. No, please. I can't leave here. You've got no choice, Sanders, and neither do we. You don't understand. If I go out, he'll see me. No, no! You're leaving this cell. Please. I don't want him to find me.
Trapped and abandoned, pursued me right into their dreams. They swooped the maps. I think. Rises up. You will choose. I will not be here to bear witness to it, because you will have released me. But the earth will resound to your cries. You there. Wake up. Come on, stand up. We don't have much time. Can you stand up? Who are you? A friend of Ethan Bradley. It was he who told me that you had been interned here. Wait. Bradley is really alive. I don't understand. You filled me... So full of drugs, I can't distinguish dream from reality. Please believe that I have nothing to do with these disgraceful treatments. Look, I don't have time to explain everything. I'm not really supposed to be here. And the same goes for you, according to Ethan. You must leave as soon as possible, and as unobtrusively as possible. I brought your clothes. Let me go ahead. We'll meet upstairs. Uh, wait a minute. What's going on here? What do they do to the patients to make them so terrified? I would really like to know. I only see them when they're brought up for medical treatment, for problems they didn't have before going downstairs. But this is neither the time nor the place to talk about that. We must not stay here. There are two men standing guard near the stairs. It's the only way to the floor above. I shall try to distract them and get at least one to come with me. All you need to do is to follow me as soon as the way is free. Understood. Alright. Well, I'm going to leave this episode here for now. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!